Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In particular video, I'll be showing you how to install Cyberfox web browser with the Hackbar extension. This particular browser um, is used by intrusion testers for web application because it has some kind of cool tool that is used to test for web application very briefly like SQL injection, cursor scripting, and so on. So I'm going to dive right into the particular of this video without wasting much time. So I'm going to uh, come into my web browser and I'm going to search in for uh, Cyberfox, okay, Linux. The first website I came up with is uh, sourceforge.net, which I'm going to be downloading the web browser from the Cyberfox browser, okay. So I'm going to open it now and you can see we have um, the download, which is you see, download latest version of Cyberfox for the 3.9.1 US Linux 86 and 64 Debian file. Okay, so I'm going to click on it, click on the download, and it's going to tell us the download will start shortly. All right, so I'm going to wait for it, and uh, as you can see, it's going to prompt us to, to download this thing. So we're going to save it to file. So I'm going to click save to file and hit OK. Okay, so it's going to be downloaded right here for me. So as you can see, I already downloaded it. I'm going to cancel this particular download because I have it on my download folder. If you have not downloaded it, let's just go through for the purpose of this video. I've downloaded it, so I won't waste much time in making this video. Okay, so what we have to download again is the Hackbar extension. So let me start in Google here. So I'm going to search for the Hackbar Hackbar, and I'm going to type in GitHub because I'm actually going to download this Hackbar extension from a GitHub repository. So the first URL that comes up is this particular one, so I'm going to click on it. So don't worry, I'm going to put in the source in the description below, okay? So you guys can get it from there. So I'm going to come to this code and copy out this URL, okay? So what I'll do now is go to my terminal. I'm going to open my terminal and let me blow this up so you guys can see clearly. Okay, so I'm going to hit, I'm going to go to my, okay, let's say, uh, CD desktop. So I'm going to clone this particular URL I copy the hardware into my desktop. So let me type in LS as you can see. We don't have hardware here, okay? So I'm going to type in git clone. I paste in the URL I copied from this hub repository. So it's going to clone this particular um, Hackbar extension into my desktop directory. So as you can see, it's cloning right here. So we'll wait for that to finish. So I'm going to open a new tab and go to my download directory. Here I have the Cyberfox file. Okay. So I'm going to go to CD download. All right. So if I type in LS, you actually going to see um, I have a lot of downloads right here. So I have the Cyberfox, okay? As you can see, this is right here. Cyberfox is this. So what I have to do now is um, let me do let me reduce this so you have to be able to see what's happening. Okay. Um, okay. So let me clear my screen. Now I'm going to type in D C K G like this and dash I. So I'm going to start typing in cyber to cyber it out and you see I the start button is auto complete because I have this cyber source file on my download directory. I'm going to type in enter, hit enter, and see as it prompts oh, thank God it prompts us for an error that you need some kind of privilege. So you have to type in sudo and type to enter so you need to prompt i have to put in my password okay so let me do that quickly and as you can see we started the installation of this cyberfox um plugins okay cyberfox web site so i'm going to wait for it to finish so before as we finish waiting for it to finish so i'm going to come to my application menu and type in cyberfox okay Cyberfox, see we have it right here. So if you follow the right the steps that I showed you, 
I'm going to have this here with two rows. Okay, okay. I'm going to click, click on it to open it right now. All right. So we have fiber force right here. Okay. So now how we I'm going to show you how to install the plugins right away. So as you can see, this particular let me zoom this this particular um cyber logo here we have we are seeing. You click on it, you see this add-ons because it's kind it's kind of extension. The hack bar is kind of extension. I'm going to click on the add-on and click on this setting tab right here. Let me zoom this a little for you guys. So you can see this setting tab. I'm going to click on it and you see install from a file, install add-on from file, right? I'm going to click on it too, and I'm going to go to my desktop because that's where I cloned the GitHub hack bar. Um, into, uh, to my desktop, so as you can see, we have hack bars fire right here. So I'm going to click on it, and we are going to click on this particular hack bar here. As you can see, we have several versions. So, whatever version you feel cool is fine, but I'm going to go to this particular version, this hack bar version 2.9. I'm going to hit open and that should be it okay so as you prompt us with the installation here i'm going to hit install and we actually have installed it so we have to restart the cyberfox browser for it to actually take effect so let's wait for it to me uh for it to come up it's going it to come up automatically so as you can see we have cyberfox right here with the hardware extension so we can actually start testing for our web application we are hacking on using this particular hackbar tool right here. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you find this video um, informative for you guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel so whenever I publish a new video, you'll be able to get a notification on it. So, goodbye for now.